If you've been following diabetes research for the last decade, you've heard the cure story before. We've been promised artificial pancreases, stem cell implants, and miracle diets. And yet, for over 400 million people worldwide, the reality is still daily management, medication, and the constant looming threat of insulin dependence. But here's the thing. 2025 might actually look a little different. There's a new procedure moving through clinical trials right now that is flipping the script. It's not a new drug, it's not a major surgery, it's a one-hour outpatient procedure that claims to reset your body's ability to process sugar. And the early numbers, they are kinda wild. In a first-in-human study, 86% of patients were able to stop taking insulin entirely and stay off it for two years. So is this finally the remission we've been waiting for? Or are we just seeing another flash in the pan headline? Before we dive into the numbers, we need to talk about where type 2 diabetes actually comes from. For years, we've had a very pancreas-centric view of the disease. We thought the pancreas was just getting tired and failing to produce enough insulin. But recently, there's been a paradigm shift. Researchers are realizing the problem might not just be in the pancreas, it might be in your gut. Specifically, the duodenum. The duodenum is the first part of your small intestine, right after the stomach. You can think of it as the traffic controller of your metabolism. When food hits the duodenum, it's supposed to sense nutrients and send signals to the rest of your body saying, hey, sugar is coming, get the insulin ready. But in people with type 2 diabetes, this traffic controller is asleep at the wheel.